Although Steam is a solid platform, there are instances when certain issues can occur. There are several factors that can cause this particular problem. In this latest video installment of our troubleshooting series, we will tackle the Steam Keeps Crashing issue. How to fix Steam Keeps Crashing Before performing any of the recommended troubleshooting steps in this video, it's best to restart your computer first. This action refreshes the operating system and remove any corrupt temporary data that could be causing the problem. First, turn off the antivirus software. There's a possibility that the antivirus software of your computer is causing this problem. To check if this is the culprit you should try to temporarily disable the antivirus software. If you are using Avast, Bitdefender, Microsoft Security Essentials, Asset and McAfee, you can refer to the link on the description box of this video on how to turn off antivirus software. In here, we will be turning off Microsoft Windows Defender. To do this, first click on Start or Windows at the lower left. Then, click on Settings, an icon that looks like a gear. At the Windows Settings section, click on Update and Security. Then, at the Update and Security section, click on Windows Security at the left side. Then, at the Protection areas of your Windows Security, click on Virus and Threat Protection. Next, click on Manage Settings. Now, toggle off Real-Time Protection tab. A prompt message will appear if you allow this app to make changes to your device. Click on Yes. Next, check if the Steam Keeps Crashing issue still occurs. Next, delete the app cache folder. If the data stored in the app cache folder is corrupted then it can cause this particular problem. To check if this is the culprit you will need to delete this folder. To do this, look for the directory where Steam is installed. The default location is in Drive C then Program Files folder and then Steam folder. Then, at the directory folder, look for a folder named App Cache, right click on it and then click then delete. Next, restart your computer. After computer completely reboots, check if the Steam Keeps Crashing issue still occurs. Next, try updating your drivers. To do this, press the Windows key plus R key on your keyboard to bring up the Run dialog box. Then, at the Run dialog box type DXDiag then press Enter or click on OK to open the DirectX Diagnostic tool. It will list all the available hardware that is installed on your PC along with the versions of the software. Use your official hardware name to search for the latest drivers available and download them through the internet. You can also update drivers using the Windows Update. To do this, press the Windows key plus R key on your keyboard to bring up the Run dialog box. Then, at the Run dialog box type devmgmt.msc then press Enter or click on OK to open Device Manager. Once in the Device Manager, right-click on the device and select the option which says Update Driver. Once you click it, another window will pop up asking if you want Windows to automatically search the internet for the available drivers or if you want to browse them yourself. Select the first option. If the drivers are the latest then Windows will pop a dialog box stating that the best drivers available are already installed. If not, it will start downloading them and install them momentarily. Check if the Steam Keeps Crashing issue still occurs.
Lastly, uninstall then reinstall Steam. One last troubleshooting step that you should do in case the issue persists is to uninstall then reinstall Steam. But first you need to back up your game. To do this, open your Steam PC client by double-clicking it on the desktop. Click the Steam button at the top right part of the window and choose Settings from the drop-down menu. Then, navigate to the Downloads tab in the Settings window and click on Steam Library Folders. Here you should see the full list of all libraries you currently use and the folders you should look for when backing up. The default folder is on your Drive C, on the Program Files x86 folder then Steam folder and then Steam Apps folder. Next, is you go to the location by clicking to open any folder or the file explorer and clicking this PC or my computer at the right pane. After that, open the location and find the Steam Apps folder. Right click the folder and choose the copy option from the context menu. Go to any location outside the Steam folder on your computer and paste the folder by right clicking and choosing paste. The best location would be your desktop. After uninstalling Steam, you will have to add the folders again as the Steam library folders as you did the first time. After you back up your game, next is to uninstall Steam. First, log in with an admin account on your computer. Then, click on the start button then click settings, an icon that looks like a gear. Click on apps which should immediately open a list of all installed programs on your PC. Locate the Steam entry on the list and click on it once. Click on the Uninstall button above the list and confirm any dialog boxes which may appear. Follow the instructions on screen in order to uninstall Steam. Then, restart your computer afterwards. Open the official Steam website then download the Steam installer. Follow the instructions on how to install Steam. Check if the Steam Fix Steam keeps crashing issue still occurs. After following the methods mentioned, you have successfully fixed Steam keeps crashing issue. We hope that this guide has been helpful. Please support us by clicking like, share, subscribe and hit the notification bell for more troubleshooting videos.